Welcome back to a new video here in Suave. To follow the same topic of the last video, if you haven't watched it, make sure to check that out. In this video, I'm going to be sharing 10 different animated backgrounds and I'm going to share the fusion compositions with you too so that you can download them and then play around with them or use it on your own projects. These three are pretty much similar in the sense that I use the fast noise and then I added colors to animate that and we use the modifier on the seat rate to make the things move a little bit. So if you make this fusion composition longer, it's gonna continue the animation for a longer period of time. So the same thing for this, it's just that I added a few more colors and play around with the different modes and stuff. So go into the fusion compositions and take a look and then see if you can change them and alter them and play around with them if you want. Now these next three, well four, they're a little more like shape based. This one is sort of like minimal. So if you want to have like a title or like a stats or something showing up in here, it's could be a good way to just add a background screen for that. Same thing for these. These are shapes that are randomly generated. So I think that if you copy and paste this fusion composition again, the movement is actually going to be a little bit different. Let me show you that. So here we have the rectangle shapes and then I actually animated the angle and the position with the shake modifier. And for that, just right click and then set modify with and then shake. And then here I just made it really smooth and you can increase this number as much as you want and then play around with the values here so that then the movement is a little bit more random and they move around. And then at the end I added a blur so that if you put a text over it, then it doesn't take too much attention from your subject and such. Similar in this style, this actually was inspired by a Sunduck film video that I saw they, they made something similar and I really like this style for these. So then I made these using a polygon and then a wa the waviness effect and that's pretty much it. And for this next one, I basically just did a basic bubble animation and use a duplicate node to play around with it. So you can reseed the duplicate and then this will change in position. For this one, I try to play around a little bit more with the shapes and try to add some interesting colors to them so that you can use these in sort of like a presentation or something like that. Now, these last two are the more complicated one. These are particle effects, so they will take a bunch of more time rendering. Actually, on my laptop, these took like 30 minutes to render. So I just wanted to let you know that beforehand. If we open this one in Fusion, we will see that it looks a little bit complicated and actually we'll get, we'll get rid of that like that. And it has a bunch of different things. Uh, I actually follow a Meissner, I think it was Meissner Media tutorial on these a while back. And then I just try to do it again to see how it looked. And I pretty, I really like this. It's pretty cool. And you can add some cinematic titles or stuff like that to them. And then on this last one, it's also a particles effect, but I use a mirror effect and then I change this to, I think, kaleidoscope. And that creates a pretty cool effect that you might see in the visuals on the screens on like uh, house music or side trends, concerts, stuff like that. So it's pretty cool. All you have to do is go to the link in the description and then you can download these for free and play around with them, adapt them to your own projects and just overall have fun with them. You can use these on any kind of projects that you want. There's no need to credit me, although if you want, you can subscribe to the channel so that we can get to 2000 before the end of the year. Now that is it for this video. I hope that you enjoyed it and I hope that you enjoyed these animated backgrounds. I will see you in the next video here in Suave. Bye.